You know, Goya opened up a multi-million dollar facility right here in H-Town, Texas. Nah. Texas being a state that has a more friendly business climate. Yeah. Shit, we got Tesla in Austin now. Now we got Tesla over here. We got Joe Rogan over here. We got Chingo Bling over here. And the state is starting to give tax breaks for film production over here. So we about to be the new Hollywood. And we're actually going to lead y'all better. We're not going to lead you the way Babylon did. All that sin and all that shit. I don't know what the fuck they doing over there. But I've been blackballed since the beginning. Um, I know I'm talented. Uh, you know, I know that I know a lot of talent. I know a whole bunch of talent. But you know what Latino Hollywood does? They rather c- cry and complain saying, there's not enough roles written for us. It's Hollywood is holding us down. There's not enough roles. Bitch, you supposed to be a boss. You should have been did this. You're not producing enough. This is what happens, Rob, with some of our Latino elite in Hollywood. They like the position they have in the social hierarchy. They like their health insurance. They like their golf membership. They're also actors. They're also competing for this handful of Latino roles. So if you like your spot in the hierarchy, you like being Latino elite, you're competing for these roles, you're an actor, you're not producing, you're not creating roles for others, you're not hiring writers and you're not saying, Orale, we have a new film coming out with, uh, we have Jerry Garcia, you've seen him on HBO, we have uh, Midnight Castillo, very funny, up and coming, we have Javi Luna, he's writing, we have Chingo Bling did a cameo, uh, we got Eric Rivera, he's originally from New York, you know, we got the Puerto Ricans in there, uh, uh, we have up and coming artists and rappers, we got we got Snow the Product, she plays a cool thing, we got King Lil G, we got Cap G in it, uh, uh, the script is amazing, it's going to, no, you don't hear that. That's not happening. That's not a thing because our Latino elite are not creating. Or oh, shout out to Robert Rodriguez. He's a builder. He creates. But these other cats, they like their spot in the social hierarchy. They're just actors. They're not producers. They're fighting for the same handful of roles. And they're just perpetuating a system. So here's what we're going to do. Texas is going to be the new Hollywood um we're gonna do some tyler perry shit shout out to robert rodriguez shout out to tesla we out you shout out to goya we're gonna have buku goya in the motherfucking in the banquet hall hey y'all want all the actors take a break come on goya just came here you know goya's over here with us now but um you would think man the scenario was oh we're not worried about these handful of roles that are getting thrown at us like crumbs we built a bread truck we got all this new talent signed to this agency that's not happening rob yeah so you know maybe that's part of why i have a bone to pick not only have they led us astray but they really ain't even deserve to be leaders they're just talented they they're good at what they do but they're just workers they're actors and they like their role they like where they're at in the social hierarchy so they're beholden we have Hollywood's like, we have you by the nuts. Do you like your golf membership? Do you like your health insurance? You better not get out of line, boy. <laughs> We're Hollywood. Where else you gonna go? Texas? 